were experimenting, and I think it was um, Jim Highsmith. He said, why don't we get together, because I think we pulled together enough information to make a statement. And so we got together, not in Ohio, not in Indiana, not in Oklahoma. We got together in Snowbird. You know, ski season, a lot of them were skiers. And we started talking about the things that we had done that were common, the things we found worked, the things we found that didn't work. And we said, well, we're not, we're not going to tell people what to do. The idea of this is you're doing creative work. What you need are guidelines and values and, 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 and um, things that can help you, not constrain you. So we said, why don't we come up with a bunch of principles and also let's come up with, with some value statements, but let's not say them as you should, this is important. Instead, let's say, if you're in a real life situation, you may have these alternatives. We would recommend that you do this instead of this because this may lead you into blind alleys, whereas this may be more open. And we published this. We called it the Agile Manifesto. Whoever came up with that name, brilliant and great name. And Ward Cunningham, um, the master of wikis, he first built that whole philosophy, um, put it up on, on his wiki, 